Yo, what is up guys? I am back with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you a pretty freaking crazy jailbreak. So we've got iOS 12.3 through the newest iOS 13 jailbreak available now. Let's get right into it. So guys, this might be one of the coolest jailbreaks I've ever seen. It's it is hardware orientated, so it isn't a software uh, patch. It, like Apple can't fix this with software, meaning it should work on any new version of iOS. So it works on the latest 13.2.2, but it should work with later versions of 13. And if there's like even even later than that, it should work. It should. It's probably only going to be fixed with new iPhone since it's hardware orientated. And that is incredible. So you could, if you bought an iPhone 10, you could have several years of of this jailbreak without it being a problem. And so there are some downsides to this jailbreak. One is that it is semi-tethered, meaning you have to connect it to a computer every time you turn off your device or it dies. Um, another downside is that it is not available yet on iPhone 10R, 10S, 11, or 11 Pro. It doesn't work on the first generation iPad Pro, and, and so those are some of the downsides of it. It's not fully compatible with all devices, but between the iPhone 5S and iPhone 10, everything works. Like it is still beta, so they're they're still adding a lot of uh, a lot of devices support to it, but as of right now, it is still in development. So now let's get straight into the jailbreak. So guys, once we get onto our computer, I will leave a link in the description where you can get Check Rain. Um, it's the beta, so keep in mind that it's not completely done yet. But anyway, once you open this up, you'll get the Check Rain disk image, and I'm just gonna go open up straight from the disk image. And so here we are, we are in CheckRain. So at this point you can go in and plug in your iPhone. And so I've got mine plugged in and we'll go ahead and start. So the device needs to be put into DFU mode. This is a manual process and we will guide you through it in order to prevent vital system corruption through hard reset, the device will be put into recovery mode first. So you can go ahead and click next when you are ready and it'll enter recovery mode. So guys, when you get to this screen, it'll guide you through how to put your device in DFU mode. I will go ahead and do that now. Get ready. Press and hold the side and home buttons together. Release the side button, but keep holding the home button. Now this will be different depending on your device, but this is the guide for my specific device. So now that it is in DFU mode, you can go ahead and get out of this, and it'll go ahead and jailbreak. And go ahead and get back to working on the phone, and I will go ahead and resume there. So guys, we are back to the device, and now what we can go ahead and do is go and see that CheckRain, the app is now installed. We can go into CheckRain. This is the loader, and you will see Cydia is right there. You can go ahead and click it and click install Cydia. It'll go ahead and download all its stuff and uh, once this is done, Cydia will be on your device, which I will go ahead and speed up. So guys, it is now done and you can see that we now have Cydia. You can go ahead and go into Cydia and it'll load up and it is now jailbroken. So guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you like the video, please subscribe. It helps me out a ton. Um, for more videos like this, turn on notifications so you never miss a video, and uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.